What's going on, you guys? Local John 1812 back with yet another food review. I'm not going to drive and record. Uh, camera mom's getting ready to come. And we are going to head to Papa John's to get the new Italian Hero pizza. And we're going to bring it back to the house to review it. Uh, reason why we're, well, the last review we did inside the house, we just haven't done one of those in a while and we thought we'd do one. And then tonight, of course, football's back. Uh, Kansas City had a great game. We won. And then she likes Green Bay, so we're going to watch Green Bay Chicago. So I said, hey, what's new in the pizza world? So she looked it up, and Papa John has a pizza called the Italian Hero. So when I get back, it'll be me and John G., you know, the son, at the table reviewing the new, um, I should look here, the camera, the new Italian Hero pizza from Papa John. So I'll be back with the pizza in the crib to check it out for you guys. Okay, be right back. All right, guys, we're back. We picked up the pizza. It's the new Italian hero pizza from Papa John's. Uh, here it is. It, it's cost 10 bucks to buy this pizza. It's a large pizza. Uh, two, four, six, eight. Two, four, yeah, six, eight. Eight slices, 10 bucks. It's got banana peppers on it. It's got Roma tomatoes. Um, onion. Onion. Italian sausage. Italian sausage, pepperoni, and... It has a creamy Italian sauce instead of pizza sauce, apparently. Uh, that's what the uh, guy at the thing said. And I looked it up online uh, when we were at the place. I took a picture of their advertisement for it, and it does say creamy Italian sauce. So, uh, that's how much it costs. Ten bucks, that's what's on it. Is it any good? We're about to find out. So, uh, here we go. They cut them pretty good, usually. So, it's easy to grab a piece. There it is. Yeah, you can see right here. That that is no pizza sauce. That's a creamy Italian sauce. So, oh, okay. Now the guy did tell me he would recommend buying it and uh, telling them to do light. Oh, this one. Look at this. This came up. Oh no. Telling them to do light. I'm trying to get him a piece. Telling him. Telling them to do light on the sauce, and but we already ordered it, so we didn't know that. But we may like the sauce heavy, so uh, we'll find out. So. Let's go ahead and bite into it and uh, see what we think. Italian hero, Papa John. And also, we're watching football today. I just have to put this out there. Go pack. I think they're losing like 14 something right now. For now. That we will pack those bears away in their little cages. The Italian heroes, I love it. It's good. It's not overwhelming on the sauce. I don't. Th I'm glad I didn't say light on the sauce. Actually, I think it's a good amount. What do you think? Yeah. I think you need a drink. I tell you what. If you <laughs> ever, if you've ever been to, and just because you mentioned another restaurant in some other restaurants thing, it's not a bad thing because. If you've ever been to like uh, Vizzoli's or Arby's, they have like an Italian sub. I think it's mainly, it could be, the one I'm thinking of could be uh, Vizzoli's. But they have an Italian sub and it almost tastes like if you went to there and took that sub and put it on this pizza and then put the, you know, make sure you had a little bit more of the Italian sauce and put it on the spread. It's really good, but you can taste the Papa John's cheese. It's always People just recognize that cheese when you taste it. No sauce. The sauce is not overwhelming. The meat is not overwhelming. The banana peppers. Everything's fine. I actually wish I could taste the tomatoes a little bit more. Maybe a few more tomatoes. Because they're good. You know how sometimes you get cooked tomatoes on a pizza and it's not that good. That's actually really good. It's weird. So, what do you it's think about one? It's a weird pizza? A, on a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being the worst. Because it's not 10. something you were expecting, huh? You give it a nine? One being the worst, ten being the best, you give it a nine? Why didn't you give it a full ten? I think it needed a little bit more uh, tomato and also um, the sauce is just... Strong? Know. Yeah. 
I don't think the sauce is strong. He does. <clears throat> I do agree, though. It should have a little bit more tomato, but guys, it's perfect. It's a perfect pizza. It's really good. It's the best Papa John's pizza I've ever had, so I definitely would buy it again. I'm going to give it a solid 10 just based on that because I think $10 is a good price for what you're getting. So I definitely would go out and try it. He gave it a 9. John G. gave it a 9. I'm giving it a 10. So the Italian hero from Papa John's is a very good pizza. Go out and definitely try it. And guys, it's really good. I mean, it's it's really, really good. So don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share. And uh, we appreciate it. And until next weekend, guys, we'll see you. Have a good week, and we'll see you next Friday or Saturday. Later, guys.